if you use a dishwasher, do I need one? Like, do you think? Oh, you need one, girl. You already know if you're Mexican, my grandma just fills it with stuff. Just like the oven. Me and Pac watched A Fall From Grace last night. Oh my God, we like, we were screaming at the TV. No basura. This bitch. The session ended, huh? Cause she's talking to her. Mm -hmm. And we're like, <laughs> like, no. What's up guys? So today we're having Dungeness Crab Legs. They're just plain, just boiled because I have a butter sauce right here. Have pepinos and baked mussels. This is just spicy mayo and you stick them in the oven. Super simple. I didn't add the, the orange thingies. Nada. Así va. That's how I'm doing it. Have habanero. I haven't had habanero in forever. Salt. And yeah, these pepinos I had cut for the kids. And they ate mine by accident, so... These are super good. I made um, I made 16 of them, but in a previous video, I have eaten like 55 or something like that. Mmm. Oh my god. Pax says she's gonna come try one. I wonder if she's gonna like it. These are so good. And if you like ponzu, you just put regular mayo with, okay, you get the muscle, you put a little bit of ponzu and then you put the mayo on top and then you bake them. What? I was just seeing if you wanted some. Of course I do. <laughs> what am I getting? Ooh. This is so good. Yeah. You try not to fall. Mm. Good? Mm? The muscles are good, yeah. Okay. They're really good. Did you give your grandpa some? Mm hmm. What do you say? The what? What did he say? Um, he loved them, but I took like, I made like 20, and my dad liked them too, so. With three people, that's not, that's nothing. Mm -hmm. That's good. Mm. You know, I love crab legs, but lately I've been like loving Dungeness crab legs. There's this buffet we went to in Vegas, and they would um like saute these, like the whole bunch of them. And like a chili sauce. It was so good. I should have did. Well, I was going to do this like a boil. <clears throat> like mussels and the crab and like potatoes. But I was like, mm -mm. I'm going to do a boil another day with shrimp and stuff. Just going to try this classic. Mmm. Oh my god. Tastes so good. Let me know if you like Dungeness or Snow better. I can't decide. They're their own beast. Oh my god. 
These are, I think they're easier to open. I don't know. Let me know what you think. I think so. Like, so soft and like, since the legs are so wide, you can always get them out easier as I struggle. Huh. So right now, after this, to make my food go down, I'm going to go outside and clean the garage. If you don't know me, I love cleaning and organizing. And before I start messing with rooms, I think I'm going to do like a series of redoing each room. So before I mess with each room, I want to clean them, declutter, get rid of anything that I don't want. Um, the baby's room, if you know, it's just two beds, a dresser, and a playhouse thing. So I'm going to get rid of that house. They don't play with it. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. Jeff built it like a dream, like a like a you know a house to play with, but I don't know if they really they really don't use it. So I think she need to go make a dog house out of it or a cat house. Oh my god, that bite was so good. I should have did the rice cakes with this. That would have been good too. You know what I haven't had in like ages? Blue crabs? We made them once. Like like fresh like alive it was scary I'm not gonna lie to you mm. we had a kid throw in each one each into the pot i think peck ran and said i'm vegetarian and run she wasn't she was just like trying to get out of it but the babies did it and puma did it <sighs> so yeah that's the plan I got a little notebook I wrote down on like I got a page I wrote down I wrote down the name of the room and then I stood in the room and then I wrote everything that I wanted to purchase for that room I really want to do one at a time, like for satisfying, like, like when I go to the store to buy something for the kitchen, I don't want to be like, oh, I'll get this for my room. I'll get this for the bathroom. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that because it's just more stressful and you're moving stuff around and you're not, you know what I mean? You're not like looking, you're not focusing on one room. So that's what I'm going to do. Trying to be nice to this because the best bite. So, yeah, of course I'll do it before and after of each room and then the whole during. Like removing everything. And then starting fresh. So, it'll be like a whole house cute thing. 
We're getting a fridge. <clears throat> That's fun. Who doesn't like fridges? Our fridge doesn't match our stove and microwave. So that's why. Mm. If you use a dishwasher, do I need one? Like, do you think? Oh, you need one, girl. I grew up without a dishwasher. I've never used a dishwasher. I mean, I've used them before, but you already know if you're Mexican, my grandma just fills it with stuff. Just like the oven. She's, I've seen her use the dishwasher maybe four times in my life. And, but at my mom's, I remember watching my sisters rinsing each dish before putting it in. But they wouldn't rinse it. They would wait till like both sides of the sink, both sides of the, everything was full. So everything's all crusted on. So they're practically washing each dish before you put it in there. I know that's not how you're supposed to use it. You're supposed to like, oh, I just had my food. Rinse it and then put it in there, right? Then you run it at night and then you empty it in the morning. That's how I see people use it. I don't know. So, if you use a dishwasher, tell me if you use it like, like my mom used to, like that household used to, or if you literally rinse your plate as soon as you eat and then put it in there. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. There's a spot there. Okay. There is no dishwasher, but if you look in the, underneath the sink, there's a plug and it says dishwasher on it. So I'm like, oh, okay. Like I could tell it should have went there, but they just put a cupboard, like a cabinet. I have crab on my chest, I can feel it. It got cold. Ooh. So yeah, I will go clean the garage right now. Just because I can't clean my shed until the garage is done. I just can't. <sighs> Pussy. Oh. To have a house, you're never done. Ooh, there's a nail. This drives me nuts. When you leave your trash on the tray. Mmm. Also, for a washer and dryer, do you guys think that the, you know, the circle fancy ones that are like front load, do you prefer top load or front load? I'm short, so top load is kind of hard. We're on our tippy toes to get that last like sock and shirt. So I don't know if with the front load it'd be easier. You're bent down though, but I'm little, so I'm not really bent bent. Why won't you come out? So yeah, just appliance talk. Let me know. Let me know what you have, what you prefer. Women, let me know. Would you go room by room? I think that's the easiest. Like, I know you will probably go into a store and be so excited. Like, oh, I need this for my room. 
or oh, I need this for the baby's room, but I just really just want to do one by one. Me and Pac watched A Fall From Grace last night. Oh my god, we like... We were screaming at the TV. Amazing. I said, and talk about the movie real quick. How you felt? Uh, I was screaming at the TV. We were bent over. We were like doing weird things with our legs. We got up, I walked out, I got water, couldn't drink the water. What is that? Some of them have that. Peck so particular. Really? In there? Mm -hmm. What the hell? There's a lot of mail. Mm. That's good. Mm -mm. Do I eat this? Yeah. Or should I give it to Pooms? No, eat it. But it's hard to get into. I don't know if I'll be able to. Like without a tool. Mm -hmm. See that. Boop. Ten out of ten. Really you like chewy. the cucumber, yeah. Huh? Really chewy. Okay, would you recommend that movie? Yes. Oh my 100%. god. A Fall from Grace. It was just... It was intense. Once I got there. Because at yeah. first, well, she, I was literally playing my game like, mm hmm. Mm -hmm. And then once she starts telling her story, you're just like, yeah. Huh. You just can't wait for more? Yeah. It's like a book. And then, like, the session ended, huh? Because she's talking to her. Mm -hmm. And we're like, <laughs> like, no. She was too. She was like, what did you want? Yeah, because the time was up visiting. Yeah. 10 out of 10. Go watch it. I said this be hard to get into. Mm. That meat tastes different a little bit. Oh, it's a claw, that's why. Trying to, uh, there we go. No basura. This bitch. Okay. Let's see. Real quick. So, yeah. We're finally going to watch the cats one. Don't F with cats. Because Pac shut it off because she couldn't stand to see what happens to the cats. So... People said just try really hard to get past it. So we'll probably do that. We were going to watch that and then I was like, no, put the fall from grace. I've been wanting to watch it, which I had no idea what the movie was about. I'm not telling you either because you don't need to just start watching it. I'm excited to get our Disneyland passes again. We're going to get them the first week of March. So I'm excited to be able to do food there. Now that... I, don't know, I feel like I have more balls. To do stuff in public.
Like, I'll be like, what? <laughs> and I, to vlog there so I can have more memories of my kids. Mmm. Holy crap. That was the best bite ever. Mm. Someone recommended a bronzer. The butter bronzer. And, oh, it smells so good. But the sponge that comes with it is so lame. Like, we're busting up. Like, why is this even in here? I wouldn't have used it anyways, the brush. Because usually it's like a little brush in the compact. But it was like a sponge. I'm like, who would put bronzer on with a sponge? I just thought it was weird. <clears throat> Crab is not filling at all. You can eat so much of it. I think I'm going to film a Q&A with Pac. We haven't done one in a long time. I don't know what to Oh, probably Chipotle. We'll do Chipotle. Because she's been wanting to do that. I think I'm getting better at uploading a little bit more. It was harder for me at first, but like now I think I got it. Also, people have been asking for me to cook more, like, in front of you guys. What are you in the hell? Cook more, like, in front of you guys, so probably do that. I have a brand new grill. Two of them. I got one for Christmas for my uncle. I haven't even, I haven't even opened the box. Because I don't want to, I'm just, like, not inspired. So if you have things that you think I could cook, on camera that are I don't know easy for that cuz like I don't know I don't know it just doesn't seem like I could cook a full meal here like dinner so it's got to be like special stuff so if you can think of things let me know that's very important because I'm gonna go shopping as soon as after this video the next day so that way I could at least do like one or two cooking videos. Like a week. At least one a week. I think that'll be good. I've been wanting these. Damn legs, they were in my freezer for a hot minute. cut off and I don't even know where I was talking but whatever I don't remember what I was talking about <laughs> I don't even want this last muscle do I mmm yeah I'll eat it mmm I'll leave this for Pumba, so she'll have three little legs. She won't like sit here and eat a whole boil, but she'll show you. Um, she likes it when I leave her the claws and stuff. This is so dirty. I should have washed it before Pack filled it up, like scrub it, cause it's like you need some degreaser or something. But anyways, yeah, this was chill. Um, if you don't like these, don't click on them. I'm sorry, like. So many people are like, you're so boring by yourself. It's like, dude, I am an adult. I'm chilling, enjoying my food. If you want to just come and enjoy your food with me, do that. 
Please follow me on Instagram. I'm trying to get to 10K so that way I can have this swipe up feature. My chonies are black. I'm another color of your chonies. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.